So you've probably heard that Google has ended the Chromecast line and it's all thanks to their new Google TV streamer. And if you've got your hands on one and want to level up your entertainment experience, then you're at the right place. Because in this video, I'll be showing you how you can jailbreak the Google TV streamer, unlocking access to endless applications, including live content, on-demand content, and even grown-up content. So let's dive in. Before we continue, I want to let you know that no matter your level of experience, this journey is for everyone. All you have to do is follow each step carefully and fully till the end for the best results. And I know I mentioned we're going to jailbreak the Google TV streamer, but what we're actually doing is we're sideloading it. So by sideloading it, you'll have access to all the things I mentioned earlier. And the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to head over to the settings gear on the top right corner, click on settings. And in settings, we're going to hover down until we see system and all this with the new Google TV streamer remote in system. You're going to hover over to about in about you're going to go down until you see Android TV OS build hover over it and click the confirm button seven times to become a developer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now we're a developer and we can continue. Press the home button and we're going to search for an application. Go to apps, go to the search bar right here and you can use the voice control button. Downloader. Results for downloader. There you have it. It's going to be the first application. Click on it and hit install. And now you just wait patiently. And when it's done, you can go ahead and open it up and you will get this pop-up message for the first time. Just click OK, hover up until you see the search bar right here. Confirm to open up the keyboard. And when the keyboard is open, you want to type in a code. The code is going to be 234753. So 234753. After you type that over, hover over the check mark, Confirm and hover over the go button and confirm again. Now it's going to start connecting to this website where it's going to download this application for us. So just wait patiently right here and it's going to start connecting to it. It's going to download it. It's going to pop up this message for the first time. So we'll have to give downloader access to download different applications. So you're going to click on settings and you're going to check downloader. And now it's going to pop up this message right here to confirm we still want to install the application we just filled in the code for. You're going to hover over install and you're going to click confirm. And now it's installing this application and it's already done. So we can go ahead and open it up. This is how it's going to look like. And what we're going to do now is we're going to add a library. This application is going to give us access to everything I mentioned before and even more. So click on add new library. Uh, click confirm to open up the keyboard and we're going to type in a code word. You'll need the code word to add the library and the code word is going to be A N D R O I T W E A K S. So exactly how you see it written right here and Droid tweaks. After you've done that, hover over the confirm or the check mark button, click on it. And it's gonna so we're in the library right now but the first thing we will receive is a welcoming message and if you want the best entertainment experience you have to read that welcoming message it's very important and besides that i just want to let you guys know no matter if you're using a google tv streamer or your phone um, or a tablet or your laptop i always recommend everyone no matter what you're doing to use a vpn and it's very important to use a VPN. And we've got a special discount with NordVPN. Check out this ad quickly. In some countries, you might need a VPN to make this work. That being said, unlock a world of online freedom and security with NordVPN by using our exclusive discount code. This will give you ultimate privacy, access to all content, and much, much more. Check out the discount link in the description. So if you don't got yourself a VPN, now is the chance. Get it and you will get a special discount. Now let's hop over to the library. Let's go into it and let me show you some things. Unfortunately, it is not clear for you, but I'm going to demonstrate on how to install one of these applications. And if you go into the library, you'll first see all files. You go down and you see the number one applications. Those are the things that I use. 
every day, like NordVPN, for instance, and other entertainment applications. If you swipe down one more time, you'll see adult content. Um, if you swipe over one more time, you'll see additional app stores. And these app stores have 1 million applications, some of them, uh, one of the two. And if you go down further, you'll see Kodi, live content, on demand, recommended tools, and more tools. So that's about everything. We have like 70 applications in this library and more will be added and it will get updated. As you can see right here, we've got two applications. I'm gonna test and showcase how to install one of these. Um, very easy, just click on the app you want in the library, hit download. It's gonna start downloading and it's already finished depending on how big the application is. It's gonna pop up this window and you're gonna click install and we're gonna have to give it permission to install it just like we did with the download application. Click OK, and you're gonna check this one also, so it's allowed to install applications. Hit back and click install. And that's how easy it is, folks. Let's press the home button and see if the apps are there. And there you have it. So if you found a favorite app, so for this, this app we just downloaded is just to close applications in the background. Uh, just for demonstration purposes. Um, if you found, you most likely will find a lot of applications you like. If you wanna put it all the way to the front, you'll just press and hold, click move, and put it all the way to the front. And you can do that with all the applications, just put them wherever you like, and that's about it. So that's how easy it is to fully load up your Google TV streamer. And I hope you'll find some apps. I'm sure of it, you'll find the right apps that will level up your entertainment experience. Let me know in the comment section if this video helped you out. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Thank you all for watching, and don't forget, I'll see you in the next one.